before Ben uh, bought us two weeks. I'm going back on a red eye tonight, and we are going to continue to negotiate to, to get these cuts uh, put in place. Um, but uh, we bought ourselves basically two weeks. Um, uh, here to do a, a town hall, which gives me an opportunity not only to explain the budget process in Washington, D.C., uh, the president's proposal, as well as uh, the Republicans that are, are we're pr putting out a number of new cuts this week. We've got to get another continuous resolution. We, we've bought ourselves two weeks, basically, to come to another compromise on the cuts that uh, uh, we're going to be pushing forward this week. This year's budget for the county, the estimate is that we will be $31 million under. How do we get to the $31 million? $16 million is in revenue shortfalls and $15 million is the increase in retirement costs. Gets us to the $31 million. Just last week, we heard that there might be another $12 million because our assessed values and our taxation, our property taxes are going to be down maybe another eleven or $12 million. So we're looking at $40 million this budget year to make it balance. Some folks may remember, you know, um, there was a, a car called the Buick Remember the Buicks, and they've been around for a long, long time, and, and they had a, a commercial when they were trying to upgrade and, and get Buicks to a little bit younger side of the market, and they go, you know, it's not your father's Buick anymore. You know, that is really what we are in terms of the government that we have, and the government that we can have. That we're not our father's government anymore, or our mother's government anymore. Uh, we can't afford that. You know, we hope that uh, we can get Democrats to agree with us on a number of these cuts. We've showed that uh, we're willing to cut at least $100 billion. We're going to go back and offer more and more cuts. Uh, it's been a very open process. Democrats were allowed to come in and uh, present their own cuts as well. We want to have a transparent and, and debatable process. But ultimately, we have to cut. And uh, the American people agree with us. We hope the Democrats will come to the table and, and make some of these cuts necessary. I'm glad to see that we have at least a, a small percentage of that, the $4 billion, um, that is $2 billion a, a week. Uh, we hope that we can come to another compromise this next week so that uh, we don't end up up against the next deadline.